Okay, our next is uh, Chimonanthus praecox. This is winter sweet number 40 on your list in the uh, Calacanthaceae, related to Calacanthus, among some other species. Uh, so, um, Chimonanthus praecox, uh, your winter sweet, it is uh, prized for its really uh, sweet, sort of waxy yellow flowers that are born in winter, as the common name would uh, uh, suggest, as a sweet fragrance, flowers are born in winter, thus the name winter sweet. So uh, the, uh, the leaves are alternately, uh, oppositely arranged. As you can see, they are quite large. It's a large, sprawling shrub in the landscape. Uh, when you break the stem, it is quite fragrant. At these, uh, the nodes where the leaves are uh, oppositely arranged, the nodes tend to be uh, quite flattened, noticeably so. And the leaves themselves, quite large, up to eight, nine inches, uh, they are scabrous, that means they have sort of a sandpapery feel. Uh, actually, if you've ever felt um, uh, uh, shark skin, it's a lot like that, whereas if you rub it in one direction, it's very smooth. If you rub it from the, uh, the, the, uh, uh, the uh, distal end towards the proximal end, it actually feels a bit like sandpaper. So it is quite uh, a lot like a uh, shark's skin. So that is uh, Chimonanthus praecox winter sweet.